So in this video, I'll be talking about vintage nail clippers. So this is a trim nail clipper. I think I bought this back in 1986 at a convenience store. And these are actually made in the USA, as you can see. It says a Bassett, B-A-S-S-E-T-T, -T, USA. Let me see what it says. Let me get the light. It says 86. So this was made in 1986. Actually made in the USA. The so quality is pretty good. I had it for, let's see, how many years? Let's see. That's 14 plus 20. So 37 years. Still good. I just put it into, um, I don't know, I had it in in my drawer or something in a box. So it's in pretty good condition. This one's also made in the USA as well. This, uh, as you can see, it says USA. I think it's made of stainless steel. Let me see what it says. It says L I T E R USA. This was made in the USA. I think I bought this at a supermarket or something back in '87 or something. This one's pretty plain, it doesn't have that filer. But you could put it on your keychain if you want. This is supposed to be a filer. I don't know if it is or not. See, does that have that? Other one has that too. I don't think that's a filer. And this one came with a metal thing. So you could hook it up to your keychain. I guess this just goes right into your keychain. Like, uh, let's see. If I like that, it just goes into your keychain. Like so. People carry it around like this. Let me get it out because I'm not going to be carrying it around. I haven't been using these. I haven't been using these for all the time. I used another pair of nail clippers. Those are much bigger. It's much bigger than this. This one has this keychain thing so you could hook it up to a keychain. Like that. I never carried mine in a keychain. Didn't didn't do that back in the nineteen eighties. And I just used the bigger one. I did use this a couple of times, but not not like every single day. It didn't tarnish or rust or anything like that. The metal was still, it's still good. I think it's uh, stainless steel so it didn't rust. There's no pitting on it or anything like that. It just shows you where it's made, like right there. I don't know about the new nail clippers, if they make trim anymore, if this is a company, but this was a, company that made a lot of nail clippers back in the 1980s and I guess 70s also that's all I want to share with you thanks for watching